Hey everyone, so today's video is going to be all about life hacks for relaxing and de-stressing. It's a really stressful time of the year at the moment, there's a lot of exams going on and life is just stressful in general. So today I'm going to be showing you ways to de-stress and relax. And for me that starts with my hair looking and feeling great. For most women, hair is their number one beauty obsession and L'Oreal Paris El Vive are running a, a lovely hair campaign at the moment which is called Hair Obsession to help us find the right hair care regime that suits us. Everyone has different hair types and different hair needs so it's all about finding the perfect routine for you. And you can do this on their website which I'll basically link below for you. Definitely go and check out the tool, it's really, really interesting. They're also running a really cool competition where there's actually a chance to win a year's worth of LV products which are tailored to your own hair type and needs so I'll put all the details below and be sure to go and check that out because let's face it who doesn't want to win a whole year's supply worth of shampoo and hair care needs that's amazing so for me the range that suits me the most is the shine neutral gloss luminizer range over time your hair can become dull from a buildup of impurities and hair cuticles become rough so hair just loses its shine so for me I'm just obsessed with this shampoo and conditioner I just kind of pop it on and lather it up into my hair in the shower. I've already done my shampoo at this stage, so this is just me putting my conditioner on. This stuff is absolutely incredible. I have a lot of hair, so I start off at my roots and I just kind of work the product in, and then I basically just kind of separate, like get the ends, and then I kind of apply more product to the ends just to make sure that I've liberally covered everything. And it just leaves my hair feeling, oh my gosh, so soft and so silky, it is unbelievable. So I just kind of work this product in, then I jump under the shower and just give it a good old rinse through. And then next I'm actually going to move on to blow drying. So this takes me quite a while because I have so much hair. I love taking the time to do my hair, especially on days like this where I'm trying to de-stress and just relax because it's one of those days where I actually have chance to just have a bit of me time, which this is all about. So I'm just going to take my hair dryer and just kind of loosely go over it with my fingers. I just kind of separate the hair that way and I'm going to go for a really super relaxed um, style today. I'm not actually going to use any other styling products on it at all in terms of straighteners or or curlers or anything like that all I'm gonna do is just then separate my hair so I'm just parting it and you can already see how super glossy and shiny my hair is honestly this feels unreal to finish off my hair I'm going to use this LV Nutri gloss luminizer extraordinary gloss booster spray this is absolutely incredible it just leaves my hair so shiny and silky smooth and honestly look at it it just looks so smooth and amazing so now that my hair is actually all done and ready to go and I'm feeling good, I've actually come to Stapleford Park, which is out in Leicestershire. This is an amazing stately home and it really holds a special place in my heart because my lovely mum got married here a few years ago. So I like to bring the dogs here for a nice little picnic and a little walk. This just really helps me just to clear my head and just sort of just get into a really relaxed state of mind. I love to look around the grounds because they are absolutely stunning. If you guys haven't been, it's definitely a Worth a check out if you're in the local area. There's a golf club, there's a spa there, but I'm just going to go and have a little look around the grounds. And then obviously the girls are being naughty and they're kind of running circles around me, but they love coming with me for picnics, obviously because they think they're just going to get some food. I have to stop all the time to play with them because they love so much fuss. B especially is a little one for having her tummy rubbed. And then I just bring my own little picnic blanket and my own little picnic box. And I'm actually in my might sound pretty sad but I'm just gonna have a little picnic by myself I think it's so important to spend time on your own especially when you're feeling stressed and like you need to relax a lot of people think that they have to spend time around other people but actually sometimes it's best just to get back to you and find yourself and just really have some me time so for me as I said that's all about being with the dogs and just having some fun and relaxing on my own so I'm just gonna chop up some cucumbers I'm trying to be a little bit healthy but also I'm gonna have some treats in here. So I drink a lot of water to try and obviously stay relaxed and de-stress. This just really helps me to refocus and recharge and I just pop a little bit of cucumber in there just for a little bit of flavor. I love to stay hydrated. I'm probably not having the healthiest food, but you know what, sometimes you've just gotta have that me time. So I'm gonna have a few little naughty treats and just actually enjoy myself because life isn't always about kind of 
eating super, super healthily, you've got to have some treats in there. Although I do have some berries, as you can see. So I'm just going to spend some time with the pups now and just relax in the grounds of this beautiful, beautiful place and just think about all the things that are making me stressed and just try to put them into perspective and think about other things. And I think that's often the way that you can kind of deal with stress the best is just to sort of deal with it head on and just think about your problems. Often I take a list with me and I make a list of things that I need to do and prioritize and I just really find that that actually just helps me such a lot. And of course, who wouldn't feel less stressed without these little monkeys in their life? These are honestly, my absolute world and they just keep me going. I love them to pieces. And then I'm gonna play some uh, some games. So this is actually balls. Um, I think it's ball or balls. I actually have no idea of the rules of this game, but I'm just having a bit of fun by myself. And as I said, that's what it's all about. And then I'm gonna play a little bit of giant chess. Why not on a day so beautiful like today? I just want to just kind of totally relax and just have a little bit of fun. And that's what it's all about when you're de stressing is finding something that just makes you smile and just makes you laugh. And then I'm gonna get changed and I'm wearing my sports kit now because I'm gonna be doing some relaxing in a minute. So I'm actually just playing a bit of croquet. I'm rubbish at this game. But again, I just love it because it's something different to do. And then this is my favorite thing to do to relax. So as well as doing all of the kind of fun sports and things like that, I love to kind of practice my breathing techniques, my stretches, do a little bit of yoga. I'm not the world's most amazing person with it, don't get me wrong. I have kind of just, I just make it up. I just look at some stuff on the internet and do a few basic poses. I'm nothing like a, an absolute guru when it comes to yoga, but I just really love to stretch out and just relax, especially because we take on so much strain. We do such a lot in day-to-day -day life and it's just so important to get that time back for yourself. So I really hope you guys have enjoyed today's video and you've got a few little ideas of ways that you can relax and de-stress on your own. And please give it a massive thumbs up if you've enjoyed it. And I will see you guys in a few days time in my next video. Bye guys.